All righty. Here's a 550 Polaris Sportsman 2013. Okay, you got noises coming from your shaking down here. You don't know if it's your engine. You don't know if it's the hoo da ha da he da ho da ho da ha da ha da ha da he da he da. You don't know what it is. Okay, all that stupid racking and noise stuff. I'm show you what it is real fast. See this coupler right here? These are couplers are different. On the 2009 to 2011, they're different. They got splines on them, and it's a little rubber seal. It's a rubber thing in there. And that nut will back off on the transmission on 2009s and 10s. There's a bolt right here that holds on the coupler. Okay, it's the same as that coupler, but it's on this side now. And it's a bolt. And if you hear noises, that bolt is coming loose. It's 125 foot-pounds. This transmission, it's easy. A moron could take this out of here. You guys, listen, don't be scared to take this transmission out. Take that transmission out. All you do is you don't have, look, I don't take off no pipes, no nothing. You see? No pipes are being took off. I didn't take off the back stuff, nothing. Okay? You're going to take this coupler off here. Look, I need to take the front axle off. The front axle's still on. I'm going to make this video real fast. Don't be shooting no stupid wise comments at me how fast this video is because I don't have a bunch of data on my phone. Okay, I'm trying to help you guys out. Okay, so I got to make it fast. I'm going to talk fast. You can't follow it and then sell your Polaris and quit your nonsense or have somebody else do it for a million dollars. Take this stupid one off right here. It's four bolts. Get in there and take it off. And then you take off your transmission. It's that simple. It's so simple, it's pathetic. You gotta get in here and you gotta take the stuff loose. You gotta take off the bottom skirt. Start with that. Break, take off your stupid bracket right here. Goes right there, little bracket. Take that off, take your stupid tire off. And then the transmission, it's got some bolts right here. This is how I took mine off. Take it all apart. Who gives two turds? Don't worry if you're doing it right and all that nonsense. Take this off, take it off in there. It goes right back on easy, okay? Don't need no special tools, no nothing. All right, and then there's your coupler. If you got a 550 and it's like this one, it's got these stupid little bolts in here. See all these little Allen head bolts? They're in there. Just move this around. Take your little stupid screwdriver. You'd be like, oh, it doesn't, it can't get in there on them. There's little stupid bolts in there. There's little stupid bolts in there. Just move this thing around. Just take it, move it around like this. Back it off. This thing will move. See it moving? Probably can't because I'm moving so fast. There you go. Moving around like that. Put some Loctite on it. Anyway, that thing breaks. If I have another one around here, I'll show you. That stupid thing breaks. Look at this. Here's the old one. It breaks. You don't even know it. It's broken sides. There's springs inside the stupid thing. Here's what it looks like. Look at this. There's springs inside there, and they break. Okay, you don't even know it. That's what's causing all that jamming, jiminy, wamming, heaving, heaving. If you got an 850 Polaris Sportsman, look at this one. Here's one right here. Look at this piece of junk. Look at this one. See something wrong with this picture? Look, it's broke right there. The thing is, I was just building a machine and seeing this stupid thing broke. So this one here is probably broke. That's fun. Got to take your whole stupid machine apart. Good old damper. Get yourself, do yourself a favor. Sell your Polaris to me and, and uh, go get a brute force or a can-am and then you're really gonna have some fun okay there you go there's your little thing i hope this helps you guys man it's just that just take your transmission out buy that little coupler it's only 280 million dollars you can get them online 280 dollars <laughs> for this stupid coupler that's what you got go on ebay and get it you got any questions stuff man hey you guys subscribe to my channel please i'm ready and uh hopefully it'll help you guys and I'll try to keep making more. There's more on my, my channel. All this little stupid stuff like this, you can get on there, man. Polaris, Grizzlies, Yamahas, all that stuff. Uh, I try to make these videos fast and I don't have much time on my phone, okay? That's the only thing I got. So I'm trying to help you guys out. Subscribe for me, man. Just take your time, dude. Just go down there and subscribe for me. It helps me. It gets these videos going. And it shows everybody else. All right? You guys can do this. There's nothing to this. Man, there's nothing to it. Don't take it to nobody. Just get your tools together. It just takes a couple tools, nothing. It's easy. All right, you can do it. Get your little service manual. Get it on PDF on your phone. It's real easy. Take your time and do it. Because if you own one of these, get the PDF and you'll be able to fix anything. They're not hard, man. That transmission, I'm a moron. If I...
a transmission right there easy comes out if i can do it anybody can do it so anyway okay look at this place it's a must all right thanks man